it's your girl Mars. It's your favorite, and there go Lex in the back. <laughs> what are so, we getting ready to do, babe? Getting ready to go get my baby, <laughs> my other baby. Yeah, so my baby. I didn't get to catch you guys up, but I may be able to in the car because um, I'm actually in the middle of trying to put my boots on. Um, so we can head out the door but we're getting ready to go get her car it's a whole long story she doesn't have the old previous car that she had when we um on one of the videos that i had previously uploaded on my channel um she no longer has that car but it's this whole big story and i'll have to tell you guys that in the car but yeah girl <laughs> is your ugly cry Bastard that did you know what's my car? Right, and you know what? The Lord gonna get you. That's alright. The Lord is, is gonna get him, ain't they? Revenge is here. So this has been the car that Lex has been driving um, as a rental. Hey so first and foremost, I'm getting tired of holding this heavy camera like this anyway. So thankfully, my tripod will be here. It was it said originally it was gonna come Saturday, but it'll actually be here by tomorrow thank goodness so yeah but anyway to get into the story and just in short detail um so we had to trade Sly in Sly is Lex's old car that's what she named her so being so we had to trade Sly in um she ended up getting I don't want to tell you guys exactly what she got but she ended up getting a new car and with the new car what ended up happening we didn't even have the car two weeks and at the time we were parking like out in the lot and of course we became victims of the whole this Cadillac converter thing. So with her old car, I believe her old car was way too low to the ground for someone to even get it. So it never gotten gotten basically. Um, and in this case with the new car, different model, different make, it probably was easier to get to. And unfortunately, not even two weeks of have her having her brand new car that we ended up being victims of the whole Cadillac converter thing or whatever. So, um, Literally, that happened way back in like what November? When did that happen? Like November, right? December. December. Okay, that happened back in December, but it is now. It really was. It felt like November, but it's now January. So she's had again the rental and things like that for over literally over a month. It's almost been like two months though. So yeah, it's just this whole big thing. So yeah, that's oh, just to catch you guys up. Oh, I'm stuck. You're good. So yeah, so that's what we're getting ready to do. Um, and thankfully to prevent that basically we've just been parking in the um, garage so yeah so I am going to take you guys with us today in between us you know getting um, taking this part back and then um, I probably won't film because I don't like shoving the camera in people's faces or like I don't know explain it like I just don't especially with other people around um, but we are going to um, go to return this car then we're going to take a Uber over to get her car um, and go from there. It's gonna be really rainy, so we're trying to beat the rain. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that part too. That part. Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. No, do you have your ticket? Okay, then back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. What happened? So we finally got her baby back, y'all. And then she cute because I definitely didn't know that she even got this little thing for our steering wheel. I think that's so cute. Yes, cause what? Carbona germs? Never. I guess. <laughs> All right, ready? Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Music to yours, baby. No service engine light coming on. <laughs> okay, so quickly, how do you feel now that you got your baby back? <laughs> the Lord is good. <laughs> All the time. And his mercy endures. <laughs> All the time, sweetheart. <laughs> Look at that <laughs> smile. Yes. United and it feels so good. Reunited 
all right y'all so hey so i'm finally back in the house now um and y'all let me just show y'all some food i got now like i told y'all i'm from philly and there's a popular place by the name of country cooking shout out to Saul. and a lot of people have mixed reviews about her food and this is why to me you got to stick to what you know and i know what i like there i'm a big fanatic about the fish um the fried fish that's my favorite um i was hoping she had oxtails today but she didn't have any um and i also got string beans and cabbage because i just been eating a bunch i had just made pepper steak and rice the other day and um when i say i've been binge eating that because it was just so freaking good like nobody when i say nobody's touching my pepper steak and onions my pepper steak and rice i'm sorry i mean that and i said what i haven't said but this is what I got, and I ate off a piece of the fish already, but I'm going to show y'all. This is what I got. My fork looks real retarded. This is what I got. Some cabbage, some string beans. Yes, that's technically, I guess, two vegetables. And y'all, don't judge me, because a girl be loading up on the fish. So I can have some now, have some later. I don't be playing. And I think I got, like, a turkey chop down there. But, yeah, it's so freaking good. Like, so freaking good. Like, y'all, just look at it. The fish is really my favorite, y'all. Like... All right, so hey y'all. So what's today? Thursday? Is it midnight yet? It's no, it's Thursday. still. What I just say? Thursday. It's Thursday. Thursday. Oh, I say hi. Let's pay y'all. <laughs> I said say hi, not smile. Say hi, girl. <laughs> it's a dimple for me. Say hi. You can't even play some Here, You play so much. I held them back. So, so we get ready. Babe put together a lovely ponytail on her own. We know it's a love hate relationship for me. Giving me all the feels with this hair. I was like, taking us back to like the first time we met. What's the point of this? I didn't have a ponytail in the first time that you met. That's one of them. My answer is to follow up. And why do you have some Get this crusty hand. Get this crusty hand. Oh, crush that. I'm speaking. Um, excuse me, this hand is not crusty. Yes, it is. It's nice and moisturized and clipped. And it look real sharp. And they're nice your and fingernails look, Your fingernails are clipped? Yes. They're long. Look at this, y'all. Let me see your fingers. Let's see. Look at them. They're, you got a French manicure on. Um, But yeah, so seriously. <laughs> oh, I see all happy. these teeth. Oh, I'm happy to be. You, you see all these teeth? Yeah, all these teeth. <laughs> That's a joke for all later. These, all these Tifas. Oh yeah, don't you start. <laughs> Cause no, I didn't know. That's funny. What was I calling you earlier? <laughs> I'm not gonna say it on camera. <laughs> You're the one that was trying to be loud, proud about it. I'm telling God. <laughs> you could tell him. He knows my heart. Shoot. Hey y'all. So, good morning. Um, it's a whole nother um day. This vlog. Um, yeah, this vlog may be a little long. I'm not sure how I want to break it up. Um, I got a lot I got to do today. I got some editing to do. Hopefully, if I have time to do it because I'm actually getting ready to um, go out tonight. And then, um, I'm actually going out to dinner. Me and my best friend, um, I have like uh, dinner plans. Um, and it's actually restaurant week here in Philly. Like I had told y'all before. I think I told y'all that in the, in another slide. But, um. Yeah, I'm actually getting ready to go in here and tidy up my bathroom um, and things like that. Um, and yeah, and then later, I'm actually going to um, do some of my maintenance, like my facial maintenance. I actually want to wax this lip because I'll be having makeup and stuff on tonight. Do not be like me. I'm just so far behind with what I was supposed to do for my actual maintenance. Um, just due to being busy and things like that that I haven't gotten to it so unfortunately I have to do it today within the hours that I have to be out so yeah don't be like me but I have to wax my lips today and I have to finally do these brows because y'all see these brows a mess a mess a mess baby a mess so yeah but that's what I'm getting ready to do let me go ahead hop to this cleaning of the bathroom before I go
what's going on so yeah um be back or whatever i just want to pick the camera up really really quick um i'm actually just washing i'm washing my makeup brushes and tools um i actually got a client tomorrow and she's getting like a three-in-one service baby <laughs> Um, and, um, also because I'm going out tonight, I have to like have everything like clean, sanitized, put away and all that before, you know, I leave, you know, and I also like, you know, my house a little, you know, tidy, my crib a little tidy before I leave to go anywhere. So at least I try, I try in this instance, that's what I wanted. So that way it would be easier for me to just, um, it would be easier for me to just figure out what I wanted to do. Also, I don't know if I'm going to spend a night at my uh, best friend's house or not. Because we're going out tonight. We're actually really just going to dinner like I told y'all. Um, but because I'm going out tonight, I just didn't know if I wanted to actually spend a night over there. Or come straight back home. So, and plus thankfully my client, she doesn't come tomorrow until about, I think 4 in the afternoon. 4.30, probably almost 5. So, I'm not mad at that, so I pretty much got the whole day. But yeah, so. All right, y'all, so we are back. And this is the fit. Let's get into it. Hopefully I'm not cut too far out. And I got my cute little, they're not knee-high boots, but they kind of come like calf boots. But this is it, I hope you guys can see, because let me see, this is it. I really like this. This outfit. And I actually still got a little time to spare. I'm getting ready to go fix the back of my little hairs in the back. But I love this outfit. I actually had like a couple of other outfits, but I put this on. It was like, yep, yeah, this the one. That's the one right there. Yep. And I also had did my makeup. Oh, wait, that's too bright for y'all. I'm sorry. So, yeah, that's better. Way better. Yeah, the girls have done their makeup. I didn't want lashes today. One, well, one of two things. One, I was having trouble with my, with my, um, I ended up having trouble with my, um, glue, my lash glue. Didn't feel like rushing into time to fixing it. Then I really liked how natural this looks with the pony and everything. I still got to fix my sides before I go. And then also, lashes sometimes end up really irritating my eyes. Like, I've been a makeup girl after all this time. And to be very honest with y'all, like, for some reason, now, as I've gotten a little older, the eyelash thing that be going on with me and my eyes, my eyes be acting like they're so sensitive now. Like, they're more sensitive than they were before. So, I'm not going to lie. A girl can do without, okay? We, and we still giving face for the girls, okay? So, yeah. So, yeah, this is me. I'm ready. Ready for the night. Ready to eat some good food. Have some great vibes. And period. Hey y'all. So I hope y'all can see me. Well, no, not like that. <laughs> but yeah, we just got to my best friend house. Ooh. Vicky's in there changing. Huh? Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. No, you know what I'm finna say all night? Think about something. And he was like, <laughs> All of a sudden, you know how like you be like, ah, not on my watch. He gonna say, ah, not on my YouTube channel. So ever since, I just been like, nah, -uh, not on my, not on my YouTube channel. Like, <laughs> ain't even talking about YouTube, but talking about nope, not on my YouTube channel. Shit. Hey, how long, man? Uh, yeah, how long before I got here? The fix them inches, of yours? Cause what? How long is them inches? You supposed to say thirty inches. <laughs> Period. <laughs> I'm weak. So Lex said, nah. Uh, Something about. You <laughs> probably made that lady in me. I didn't even know what <laughs> Sorry, y'all. We having technical difficulties. But we got a little drinky drink. What'd you say, Vic? Huh? What'd you just say? I thought you said something. Oh, let me get it. The red button on? Yes. Okay. Oh, I'm supposed Not to talk. Not just here, right? I'm supposed to talk? <laughs> yes. Oh, well. I'm gonna add it so you could. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome to our YouTube channel. <laughs> now I'm just a vlogger. <laughs> Chill, I don't know nothing about no YouTube. Come on here, Victoria. Hey, Miss Nam. 
Not the happy feet in the hills. I'm weak. <laughs> How they do the dance? Oh, eight. Oh, eight. Oh, child. I'm weak. All the time. Oh, look at the Okay. So we finally are on our way, you guys. Okay, Hills, you better walk. Walk, 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 walk. <laughs> So you guys, we have arrived. So Vera Rosa, Vicky left me. Vicky straight left me. And oh wow, you said it was nice. This is safe. We're at Vera Rosa. Oh, this is what I wanted to get. I don't know if you guys can see that. You probably can't. Wait, often I, I followed their recipe the first time and then mm -hmm. I just started doing my own fucking spinning thing. That's, that was, that's all cooking is. That's okay. all the experience is. Like, literally, it's whatever you like for your table. Like, okay. <laughs> I'm not just doing something. I don't know. We have our wine flies. And what was, I remember Moscato, huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pinot Grigio. Mm -hmm. What was that? Mexico. Okay. Mm -hmm. Moscato. Mm -hmm. Pinot. Mm -hmm. What was that? Alright, guys. Alright, which one is this one? Oh, no, that's not. I like how it tastes. Don't you know when we were in the, the, when we was in the DR too, it felt like. You've been to the DR before, right? I know. No? I'm actually really scared to go because I know I'm never going to come back. True, because I'm not gonna lie. We actually hit a plateau that we did want to come back at one point. Like, because we stayed for seven days and we did start feeling like the trip was a little long. But um, it was very beautiful. And they don't have, when you order sweet wine, it's like they don't know what that is. Because every wine that they kept giving us was not sweet. But you gotta try the mama wine out there. Get you lit. It's dark. Her dad goes to be here like all the time. Mm -hmm. She wants to like move out here. Okay, thank you. She mm -hmm. wants to move out here. Mm -hmm. So he goes out there like four, four or five times a year. Mm -hmm. <laughs> DR, got gotcha. you. No, because I was going to say, I know I heard too with the Mama Wines. I think apparently they um, have you out Jamaica too, I think. I heard. No, so don't tell me. You said don't tell me? Okay. I definitely want to go to Jamaica though. Sorry, you guys. This one's rose. I don't know. When I last had like anything rose, I don't think I like it. This was not bad though. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I think when we were drinking at home, I said drinking at home. When we were drinking at your place, that's what kind of opened my palate. The, uh, the it like opened my palate up to everything. So, Moscato is sweet, of course. Not working. They give me a headache. I'm. And then I would say rose. Which one is this one? Before the bubbly. Pinot. Pinot. I think I might have had this one too, and I don't know if I liked it. Oh yeah, hell no. <laughs> Don't like that one. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like this tastes like beer. It tastes like beer but flat. It tastes like a real nasty beer but flat. And this one was the Moscato, right? Real bubble. But how people taste. That's like this one's gonna go. Yeah, you better confuse yourself. Mm -hmm. These are three I like. This one I didn't. Mm -hmm. I got this. I got this over here on this side. My bad. <laughs> the bruschetta, right? Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Yum. Yeah. I got calamari. So I got the shrimp and lobster. I know that's what I'm saying. It's 2023. Why? Oh my. Tane a la Nora? Yes. Okay. Okay. You gonna try it? Oh, I'm getting it on camera. <laughs> I 
Wait, I wonder if I can sit right here. I might just sit Dominique because she's not going to believe I tried it. <laughs> I'm going to sit in Dominique because she's not. She's like, let me try this. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I don't like thinking about regular and just writing it, but I'm going to have to. There's a white piece in there, and there's some green stuff in there. Because I love that song. Every You're a wild girl. Club. You're disgusting. Club made me do it. And I believe it. And I, I didn't like it. I didn't think I was going to like it. Oh my God. I think we're trying. I'm not trying that shit. I didn't think I was going to like it. I don't want that, I don't want that green stuff. <laughs> If I could have got it without mm -hmm. the ricotta cheese on the top, I would give it about a seven and a half. That's good. That's perfect. <laughs> we got our Sicilian cannoli. All right, so hey y'all. Huh? Go on, sis. Go on. Go on with your bad toe. <laughs> Period. I love my little outfit. That's how I love my little outfit. So we're going to some bar. You know the name of the bar? The Locals Bar, what? Oh, Locals Bar. Can y'all see my shirts off? Look at my shirts off. What is that about? Hey, yo. It's the same so, in culture as it is in archaeology. When a civilization collapses, as you can see, only the time I have a fragments. fresh face now. Okay. Well, we they get my that. best friend's place. Huh. Make recordings. Real people they already know, want to hear. Relax, Sam. Yeah, so my best salt. friend's actually getting her hair washed. Her girlfriend's um, helping her yeah. wash her hair. Yeah. So I'm just in it by myself right now. What's this podcast about? Well, um... Okay, so hey y'all sorry for the blackout screen in advance um unfortunately i lost a specific clip to this video where it will not complete um and come off of my camera so i just want to explain um in the next clip that you're about to see um it's basically just going to start where i'm actually talking about this guy where when I actually had gotten home and I had the time to actually privately talk about um, there was a guy when we were at the bar um, that prior night um, that was sitting next to me. And you may have seen him in one part of the clip, I think, next to me, possibly. I don't know. Um, and he was acting a little strange. So that's basically what this part is actually detailing. Without knowing anything, you probably really would have thought like, yeah, this, you know, this is kind of weird. Like he was on a lot of staring. Um, and then... He was doing a lot of other behavior because I was sitting right di right directly next to him. But my my best friend, she didn't. She was saying the same thing like, why is he like, why is he doing it like, or why is he staring like? It's giving kind of weird. So, um, but again, that's the initial thought. But I started to think like after like looking at like the stuff that he was watching on his phone, and then like even when we left, he was like getting on his bike, and he just was he was just acting a little like strange like. You know, he was acting a little strange. So he was acting a little like, you know, just, I don't know. We we couldn't quite pinpoint it. So, um, but other than that, um, really wasn't our business. So, um, other than that, I really enjoyed myself. Um, and yeah, I got to really do more of that because one thing about me and my best friend, like, you know, our lives, everybody's lives it got really, really like, not necessarily busy, but because everything was like so shut down during these past couple of years, everything's, you know, getting back, you know, um, getting back to the things that we like doing, you know, and also I feel like, you know, it's important to kind of like, you know, strengthen relationships, friendships, and you know, things like that. So I think that's really, really important. Um, so that's basically what me and, you know, my best friend is, you know, working on. And, um, 
yeah so so i really did enjoy myself i definitely got to do it more often your girl got to get back outside because to be honest like i said during the pandemic time and like pandemic i was sick and i was sick fighting for my life and then i was you know trying to hone in on my skills with running my business 2020 21 i was trying to still get myself together recover from surgery and still trying to get back into the swing of things and then finally 2022 like i told y'all i wasn't playing with nobody not even myself i wasn't sleeping on myself in 2022 and i did what i had to do and now we're here so i'm ready to get back out have fun love on me a little bit more remember who i am in this relationship um get back you know link up with my friends you know my family <clears throat> you know those that are supporting me i'm supporting them you know things of that nature so i'm just ready to be outside i'm ready i'm ready to be outside okay so and not only that i'm getting ready to be you know um you know put myself in a good transition of being healthier you know new body coming soon <laughs> period and yeah i'm ready to be back outside living living okay so that's that but um yes this will be the end of this vlog for today i will see you guys on another one until then Thanks for watching and tuning in, guys. Be sure to subscribe, and I will be sure to catch you guys on the next one. Bye.